this is Sean with Gate City. You know from watching my channel that I always use PVC pipe, but I recently had a job where I replaced some corrugated with PVC, and I thought it might be a good time to highlight some of the, the things that corrugated beats out PVC on. And so I'm gonna show you this job that I did where I just replaced a short section of corrugated, but I'm gonna use that to frame and talk about some of the benefits of corrugated and some of the things that corrugated just, just beats out PVC every day. So I've got seven benefits of corrugated that I wanna show you in this video. This is Sean with Gate City Foundation Drainage. I'm on a job today replacing a piece of corrugated. So what we have here is we have a couple of gutters back in the backyard and they're coming through to the front here and the corrugated's clogged up. So the homeowner had a company come out here and clean them out and found that it's all crushed right here. So what I'm gonna be doing is just hooking on to the existing corrugated and turning it into PVC out to the curb. So it should be a pretty straight run for me. There's gas right here, but that's gonna be really deep. And then I'm just gonna redo this little outfall here. I'm also gonna take the two pipes into one PVC pipe. What I have here is a corrugated with one of these little push connectors and the roots just grow right into it. They grow right inside these connectors. So look at that, it's not sealed. So the roots just get right in there. Look at that, it just grows right in there. The shape of the corrugated pipe means that each of the little ribs is going to hold water in there. And so if you have thirsty plants nearby that, that are looking for water, you couple the fact that this, this pipe is holding water with the fact that the couplers just click together, means the roots can get right into that pipe and get that water. That water will be holding in that pipe and the plants can go right in there for it. So if you have thirsty trees and shrubs nearby, that is a great pipe. You can see here, we're doing some snaking on a corrugated pipe and it's just covered in roots. So this entire pipe that we're working on here, the, the plants just love it. And let's not forget that the little ribs in the corrugated pipe also trap organic matter and that organic matter is full of nutrients that the trees are gonna go for as well, the roots are gonna go for. This is a big six inch corrugated. It looks like it's been mowed over a few times, but look at that mosquito habitat. See all, I don't know if you can see all those mosquito larvae in there. Corrugated pipes ability to hold water not only benefits plants, but it also benefits animals, as in this example. So this piece of corrugated pipe is holding a bunch of water, which is creating habitat for specialist, container specialist mosquitoes. And the larvae live in the, in the water here. And so I especially like this example of a benefit of corrugated because I did some container specialist mosquito habitat research as an undergrad and we were looking at tree holes and so this corrugated makes a perfect artificial tree hole for these species to inhabit but they're all in there sometimes if you tap it they'll they'll move around you see all those mosquito larvae oh yeah we're gonna mess with their habitat mm. that just sounds like a this little bullfrog just came out on the corrugated. I think he was living in there. So, I don't think I heard him, but usually these things are pretty feisty. We'll see how he does. Oh, there he goes. So that's why you don't want to use corrugated. You want to use sealed, glued PVC. Okay, so we're going to try to get onto this piece here. And they just cleaned it out so it's hopefully in decent shape. The next thing I want to do is get all this natural coverings, the pine needles and the mulch, pulled back over the work area so I can dig my trench and then put this stuff right back over top of it. So I'm just going to pull this back with the rake. Look at that. 
I just found two worm snakes. So they're usually in material like this. These are nice snakes. I'm gonna reposition them over there somewhere. Okay, I've got my angles pretty much roughed in, got my pipe laid out, and I got it painted. So that's where my trench is gonna go. I've got a 22 and a half right there, and then it pretty much straightens out pretty nicely to the curb out here. So I may have to move it around a little bit or kind of angle it. Now that I've got the pipe location marked out and laid out, I can now trench it. And I'm going to be running into the existing corrugated pipe, but that's okay because the trencher will go right through it like it's nothing. So that's one of the benefits of corrugated is the trencher goes right through it, no problems. Another really nice feature of corrugated pipe that's built right into it is it is super, super easy to replace. And so you don't have to locate the old corrugated pipe. You don't have to worry about any of that because the trencher will just go right through it like it's not even there. And so this makes replacing old corrugated pipe with new PVC really, really easy because you don't have to dig it up. You don't have to locate it. Even if you don't even know there's corrugated around, it still is very forgiving to replacement. So in these clips here, you can see I'm just kind of randomly going through where I wanna go and there just happens to be some corrugated pipe in there. And luckily for me, that doesn't pose any problem for the trencher at all. You do have to clean it up afterwards and I'll talk about that as a benefit here coming up. Here's another clip, same thing. We were just trenching across the yard and we just happened to hit some corrugated and it didn't matter at all because the trencher goes right through it. And you can see here, this is another benefit of corrugated. So that puppy dog right there, there's no way he could get his mouth on a, a four inch PVC pipe. And yet he was able to grab that and go play with it. Getting back to the project here, take a look at that outfall and you can see all the water that's coming out of it as I disrupt that corrugated pipe. So that was all water that used to be available for plants and animals to use. And when I replace this corrugated with PVC, that's no longer gonna be available for them. Okay, I got everything trenched and I wanted to show you one of the things about corrugated pipe is it holds water. So you can see all that water that gushed out of there as I was pulling that pipe up with the trencher. So that was all water that was just hanging inside that pipe. Another really handy benefit of corrugated pipe is it packs down really, really well to fit in your dumpster. So take a look, all this pipe right here from there all the way to there fit in that one little bag. And see, look at how well it crushes down and packs. So you can pack a whole lot of pipe in your dumpster with this corrugated, look at that. If you've been watching my channel for a while, you know that I don't like corrugated pipe. But I have a chance here to show you one of the benefits of corrugated pipe. I'm always talking about the drawbacks of it. But it, let me show you one of the benefits of corrugated pipe. It's much easier to clean up than PVC. So let me show you.
that look at that now you can easily stack these things right on top of each other and they don't take up as much room in the dumpster so that's the benefit of corrugated pipe it's easy to clean up that's one of the main benefits of this stuff is it doesn't take up a lot of room in your dumpster or in this case in my trash bag another benefit of corrugated pipe is you can cut it with almost any tool you have available so look at how far away my sawzall is my sawzall is all the way in the truck right there so do i want to walk all that way when i've got a shovel right here no so one of the benefits of corrugated is you can cut it with almost anything So look at that, save me a trip all the way to the truck to get a Sawzall, which I didn't need. And there's another one right there. There's another good image of how the roots get into this corrugated. Look at that. It's just that whole huge root in there. Look at that. So there's no way you're gonna clean that out. I don't care what kind of snake or what you've got. It's just entrenched in there, in all those ribs. There's no way those, those roots are coming out. So look at that. So that's another benefit of corrugated is you're feeding the plants with all that held water. So definitely good stuff. To attach PVC schedule 40 four inch to four inch corrugated, we're going to use a Fernco. This is a flexible coupler, Fernco for short. And this one specifically goes from the corrugated into the schedule 40. So the first thing I need to do here is get a clean edge on this old corrugated pipe. Okay, now you've got to go kind of easy because this drill will crush this corrugated. So just go, go easy and it'll tighten itself right on there. Because we have a long run of corrugated, I want to install a clean out right here. So I've got a sanitary tee and I'm actually going to send it backwards so you can clean out in that direction. Another really nice benefit of corrugated pipe is apparent when you go to install it. So what happened here with this previous installation is their trench was too deep and once they came to the curb here, the curb was higher than their trench. 
And so if you watch me as I'm pulling this old corrugated out, you'll see that it's just angling upward. And so that's a really nice feature of corrugated is if you, if you run out of fall or if you have an obstruction or a rock or something, this corrugated pipe will just bend and go right over top of it. So take a look at this pipe and what it looks like when I pull it out. In this example, we were replacing a piece of corrugated with some PVC and where it was coming from off to the right there was much, much lower. And then right here by this power, there was a big chunk of concrete. And so the installers just bent the corrugated up and over that chunk of concrete for a nice, easy install. But as you're gonna see in a sec, we had to bust that concrete out of there to get our PVC pipe to fit. So that's a major benefit of corrugated is it will bend upwards and over obstacles. You all probably know that I don't install corrugated pipe, I install PVC. So because of that, we're gonna have to bust this concrete out of here to get this pipe to fit. If we were going back with corrugated, we could just go back up and over this residual concrete in here like they did before. And that would have been much, much easier to install this. But we're not doing corrugated, we're going back with PVC. Here's another good example where we were installing some rigid PVC and we hit this huge rock, it was right in the way, and you see off to the left that rigid six inch. Now if we had been using corrugated, we could have just bent the corrugated up and over the rock, but since we were using PVC, the PVC doesn't bend and so it we have to get rid of this rock so that the PVC can lay flat in the trench. So corrugated would have been, been a much, much easier installation in this example. Yeah, with the right tools. Right, beyond the limits. Because a normal man wouldn't be able to do that. A normal man, when you got a superhero out here, you got it taken care of. <laughs> Country Corey to the rescue. Okay, <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and let that concrete set up for a little bit while I get this covered up. So. I had to really mind my fall going across here, so I had to lift the pipe up a little bit. I had a ton of fall across here, and then I was kind of running out over here. So I brought this up a little bit to spread some of this fall out to get down here where I needed it. So it's really important to get the pipe where you want it before you get things covered up. I'm finished with this job, so I also gave him a clean out there, and that sanitary tee was facing backwards. So you can clean out that side of the corrugated. The PVC doesn't ever need to be cleaned out, but if it does, you can come in through the curb. So I got all the pine needles and mulch put back over top of the pipe and the trench. Got some concrete in there and we should be in really good shape. I thought this project would be a good time to talk about some of the benefits of corrugated. I'm always talking on this channel about how PVC is superior to corrugated, and I still feel that way, but I did want to take this opportunity to talk about some of corrugated's better attributes. My favorite, of course, is the habitat creation because many of you know that I'm a biologist. This is a degree in biology right here, and so I especially appreciate all that mosquito habitat and amphibian habitat that the corrugated creates as well as feeding the plants and shrubs and, that may be nearby. So I hope you all have enjoyed this video and hopefully you've learned and gained a better appreciation for corrugated pipe. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to support the channel, you can do so here and you know what to do. And there are links in the description if you'd like to become a patron or buy me a coffee. Thanks.